back igniters. Oming out this igniter is only one of the two ways you can test the integrity of the igniter. The second thing you want to look for is any discolorment. You see the normal color. I'm trying to do this without touching it here. But you see the normal color of the igniter is black and shiny. If the igniter has any white spots or any signs of cracks, either top, bottom, or middle, even if the igniter is under the own rating, still recommend replacing that igniter because guys, if cracks show up on the igniter, even if the igniter ohms out within range, if that crack gets worse, it's only a matter of time before the igniter breaks. I actually seen that before a couple of years ago when I was doing maintenances. I actually only went by the ohm reading. I never visually looked at the igniter and sure enough, I ohmed out the igniter today. It was at 52, next day it broke. And I was flabbergasted, but lesson learned, guys. Always, when you own my igniters, get a flashlight.